Hey there, planner friends. It's Hope with Hope's Plans. So it's that time of month again where we do a flip through of the stuff in my planner and whether it was successful or a big fail. Last month I used this wrong, wrong fabric cover that I made from Joann's. I absolutely love it. I will be offering it in different sizes as long as the fabric is available. So come check me out on Instagram and see when they will be available for purchase. Right now I am in this beautiful cover um, that I also made because I'm really enjoying making covers. Um, I did pick up this fabric from a thrift store. It has Yoda with a green backing on it and it's good for the month. I don't know if I'll necessarily use it a whole bunch, but it turned out good. So let's get into the nitty gritty. So in my side pocket here, I started making a routine. I do have some stickers, which I made, which are scales, as well as my homemade star paper clip. It was supposed to shake, but that was a big fail. I'll try it again with something else. So that's what we got in there. And then we have my Weight Watcher book as well as some recipes I want to try. Inside my front cover, I just have sticky notes that I plan on using some point in time for something else. Um, this was gonna be my index page. Obviously, I didn't fill it out. Maybe I'll come back to it, maybe not. Nothing has changed here. It's still my cover page with this beautiful print. I did have this in my disc bound. I just taped it in. 2022 and 2023, I need to mark off July. I don't know if next year, if I will put the year to come because my book probably won't last that long. So, or maybe I'll put it in the back, I'm not sure. This was the um, perpetual calendar for me or the future calendar log. I don't have nothing in here. I won't do this again. It's already in my collection book. Next up, we go into June. I just have a vellum here. Um, I think, I'm not sure where I got this printable from. No idea. And then I just put the important dates for the month of June. Use some Happy Planner stickers. I think this was a Parker Lane washi that I picked up from Joann's. I'm not quite sure though. And then my habit tracker. As you can see, my habit trackers are a big fail. Um, from June 17th on, I didn't even track. I'm good for the first part of the month. After that, it's just downhill from there. Um, this is my washi tape that I picked up in the month of June, as well as another vellum that I did make. My weather tracker. I track weather monthly, and I could just flip through this page each day to see what the weather is going to hold for me. I screwed up this page, so I just used a Happy Planner divider and just type, taped and glued it down. I have a little sticky note, and this is just um, where I posted the Starry Universe washi on Facebook. I just wanted to remember, as well as my pet washi, and these are just sticky notes I just stuck on this page. And then we just get into my June log. I was trying different layouts throughout the month of June. And I didn't like any of them. I am definitely a daily planner. See, this was June 22nd through July 3rd. I didn't even, I just wasted a whole page, two pages. And then we went into my thoughts and ideas on the left-hand page. I never even looked at this again. And then I started my daily pages. 
I find that daily pages give me the most room to do some doodling, maybe put some sticky notes in. I track my food in my water and my coffee, as well as my to-do list. If I post on Instagram and Facebook, uh, this is something I wanted to remember, which I never did anything about. More doodling, more doodling. I am not a white space person. Like if I look back at this, this right here drives me crazy just looking at it. But I do Saturday and Sundays on one page. I don't have a lot going on and I don't track my food on the weekends. This was gonna be a to-do list as well as meal log for the week. And we're in June 13th, still daily pages. And then we go into washi. This is the pet washi that I bought from Amazon. If you're inter interested in the full swatches, go check out my YouTube shorts, as well as my Star Universe. And then just questions and thoughts and ideas I had. Another vellum, as well as a scrapbook paper that I picked up at a thrift store probably. But I thought it was good. My printer jammed up a little bit and made the wording a little smeary, but I don't care. More thoughts and ideas. It looks like I had a little food log going on. This is Monday, June 27th. Use some washi tape that I picked up somewhere as well as my pet washi. Here I started tracking my weight and workout and steps. I love using washi and stickers, so I will continue doing that as well as stamps when I think about it. And then we're into July. I have a clean list, a brain dump, and I'm not sure where the sticky notes came from. Maybe Brooke Evans? one of our free printables as well as the calendar which I printed on vellum and then I just use reposition tabs from Avery or Post-it or someplace and I put my own bows on it. Got a currently page. I filled out most things. I didn't do proud of, listening, or best which I can come back and do. We're only in August 3rd. I did want to lose 20 pounds this month. Ha! Huh? That's funny. Um, but I did lose 9.6 pounds, so that's good. I've been to the gym a lot this week, but really concentrating on my food. And then on my YouTube and Instagram logs, as well as I did buy a Clorigan calligraphy pen um, from Hobby Lobby just to try it out. It was very cheap, maybe $3, $6. And this here just gives me some information on it. So I just stuck it in here. Habit tracker that I didn't use, meal logging, and then I just go in my daily pages for July. It looks like I was just using colorful boxes but I don't have any stickers, so I'm just using my markers, which are Crayola Super Tips. I love these things. I was tracking my daily steps, my workout, and my points used from Weight Watchers. I loved using the breakfast, lunch, dinner, and snack idea. However, I didn't need all that space more doodling. Not sure what I was trying to go for there, but hey, I was doodling at least. One day somebody's gonna look back at this book and go, what in the world was she thinking? I didn't even, I'm not even sure what day this is. Must have been the weekend. Didn't even, I must have got busy. It was Saturday, July 9th. No, that was Friday. What the world? Oh, I was doing a day on two pages. 
can't even use it. So I wrote down a little bit for Saturday, Sunday. That's why I'm going to Saturday and Sunday on one page because really. July 11th, I'm back into a day per page, still tracking my weight. I have little feet there, but I obviously haven't tracked that. Um, I'm still tracking my spend log, my sleep log, and my workout time. I have moved my to-do list to the bottom as well as my food log. I am enjoying this setup right here. I am continuing on this setup into July. And I'm just putting random stickers down where there's space or doodling or. I'll go through this real fast because they don't change really. Using some washi. This week, this month, I did the best of July and I just put a little note of things that I did that is also in my memory book, but this way I. If I ever look at this again, I can see um, my July step log. I did get to the 28th of July and fell off, as well as my weather tracker. Got to the 24th of July and something happened. Who knows? Habit tracker. Let's see. I got to July 29th this time. Woohoo! I didn't do my sleep log or my mood log, but it looks like I did habit trackers on the 29th. So I'm getting a little closer to the end of the month. Another washi sample. I'm going to South Carolina in September, so I'm making little notes on that. The classes I'll be taking, so I just have Monday through Saturday. We will be in South Carolina starting Saturday. We'll be try we'll be leaving Tennessee to go there on Saturday, but I won't actually be in Myrtle Beach until Monday. Making little icons. What was this for? Productivity sheets, I think. Maybe left-hand pages for Charleston, so vacation ideas, kitchen renovations. I'm just writing out here all my previous vacations. It's interesting to look back to see what you've done. Um, vacation ideas that I want to take in the future. Antelope Canyon. If you've ever been to Antelope Canyon, hey, tag me on Instagram. I would love to see your photos. More vacation ideas. Must have been really on my mind this this at this point in time my July budget. I did have a quarter savings, a dollar savings, which I didn't make either one of those, and unused, which I didn't. None of those goals worked out for me. And then we're into August. So that's how my June and July have went. Let's see. This is the unused portion and this is the used portion. So I think I will be able to go until the end of the year, hopefully. Um, let's check out what's in the back here. I started ideas for next journal, what I don't need and do need. So as I said before, I don't need the first page of the book. I don't need an index. What I do need is more doodles and make a consistent theme throughout the month. Some video ideas, so don't look at that. List makers are going to list. Isn't that the truth? These are my weight loss, which I only did up until July 18th. Today is the third, and I know today I am 155.6. my tracker for my stats, which I need to do. And I don't care to join the show everyone. Yes, I was 160 pounds starting July 2nd. It is what it is. Um, I was making a cleaning list. I don't like to clean. Whoever likes to clean, congratulations to you. I am not a cleaner, obviously. 
Um, I don't know where I got this, but this is a tab placement. So I just stuck that in here for future use. Uh, more cleaning. Oh, cleaning recipes, cleaning supplies. I forgot I even put that in there, which I'm not sure why I should put that in my recipe book. Grocery shopping, I do look at this frequently. So once a month, this is what I have to buy. I buy things bi-weekly and weekly, which I no longer need charcoal or lighter fluid because now we have a gas ground. This was kind of like the list that I want to make. So I have bucket list, grocery list, travel list, pen list. Um, but I decided to make like an index on this page. So I have a habit tracker list. Well, my habit trackers are found on page um, 10 and 11. My washi tape is found on page five, page 35 and 36 and page 99 through 101. My vacation ideas are here. It seemed to work out better for me for some reason. Um, I got a trigger list, which I have no idea where that come, came from, which I will put that down in the comment box. And while I'm talking about down in the comment box, hit the notification bell, the subscription button, and the bell so you don't miss any future contents of me rambling. Some more sticky notes. This is just things I want to look at in the future. I don't want to forget. So I want to look at Sterling Ink, Planner Press, Planner with B, or Plan with B, sorry. Um, look at Amplify Planner pin Printables and my pen test. Oh, I also have my box counted. And that would be it. This here is just sticky notes. And I did make my name at the back of the page because I made a mistake and it was supposed to be the front and I thought it was the front but it wasn't it was the back and then I did pick up this book here this is from Hobby Lobby and this holds passwords I don't keep my very sensitive passwords but this is passwords for um, like my Google Drive or an embroidery website that I belong to. I have all that written in here. In the very back, I do have these color palette sticky notes that I picked up from Amazon, my page marker, as well as these are the stickies that I wanna look at. And I do have additional stickers for the month. So if I have additional room in my planner pages, I could just stick them down as I need to. Let's see, what is today? So this would be Tuesday, yesterday. And if I wanted to put something right here, then I just have my little stickers and I would put it right there because I hate white space. So that's just a quick little flip through of my June and July in my A5 365 Stology. If you have any questions, leave them down in the comment box. And as always, hit the video to the left right there and the video to the right. And then smash my head so you can subscribe. As always, stay safe and keep on planning.